Hello everyone. I have a half day kind of of work because why does my crotch look like that? Okay. <laughs> because um I'm getting an award. <laughs> I just noticed you my queen You looking like some buttercream You know exactly what I need Hot cocoa sweet So I'm only going to be having two of what would have been five classes today um, I'm going to my two morning classes And then I have to go to the education office to get my award Now Normally, I would just roll up in some jeans and a nice shirt <laughs> or something, but I feel like pictures are going to be taken, you know? I'm, I'd be foolish to think that pictures wouldn't be taken. So, I'm freaking out about what to wear. So, I got a dress specifically because I, I thought that I need a dress for occasions that is conservative enough but also my style that like i can just wear the only occasion that popped into my my mind as i was getting this mind you was like a wedding i've never been invited to a wedding here but i was like if i ever was invited to a wedding i could wear something like this and it looks really cute the only thing i don't like about it is the waistband korean outfits do this a lot where the waistband will go up will be more like a baby doll dress so the band is here right under my boobs instead of at my waist um i would love to take the band out and move it down but i don't have the the sewing skills for that um so i'm not sure if i want to wear this or okay so this is the pants and sweater option I feel like this isn't so bad you know you know we could we can make something work it doesn't look that bad especially with the with the jacket on I feel like everything is just gonna look a lot better I'm not particularly happy that I have to wear my hair in a bun I prefer my hair to be done by now especially because it is winter but it is what it is and then, yeah, I have my little bag. I feel like this is what I'm going to go with. I really don't want to wear a dress, mostly because I know I'm going to have to wear stockings. And those are so annoying to wear. I also have my little heels on, which y'all might be thinking, why are you wearing these colored heels with, like, all of this? Um, because I want to. These are like the lowest heels that are still heels <laughs> that are still heels that I have and I feel like it doesn't throw off the outfit that much so if anything this ends up being like the blue blam of it. I'm still wearing black so it matches there. The only additional colors are the white and the blue which I think is fine. Yeah, we're just gonna go with this, so I'm not even gonna try on the dress. Cool. Okay, so, uh, I didn't think to bring my camera with me because I didn't think that I would want to record. Um, and I was right, I did not want to record in that situation because literally what happened was the people who got awards, um, all met up at a restaurant. We had lunch together and then we went into the Office of Education for like the whole county um, and we went directly to like the head person which I did not know was a woman like this entire time I've never seen her before so this is the first time that I saw her and I was just like what <laughs> for some reason I thought I really did think that it was a guy who was like the head um, she was so nice, but she did not talk to me at all, which, like, to be expected. Um, there were, like, six or seven people getting awards, and one of them was someone who works at the, um, in the Office of Education, so she wasn't there when we were, like, in 
the head honcho's <laughs> office and we were just like sitting there having tea they were making conversation I was sitting there being awkward as usual because honestly when would they ever throw the ball to me to, to start talking I would I was honestly like please don't please don't do that <laughs> um and then we went into like a kind of meeting uh like a board office um you know how like they have like the board meetings and then it's just like this huge round table with everyone sitting like it was that kind of a office that we all went into we all you know bowed received our our awards and then after everyone received their awards they were like okay now all the people who received their awards are gonna go now because <laughs> they were just like there's no need for you to sit here for this um but nor so last year this was an actual like event that they held where like teachers could go to the office of education and or like somewhere else we i think we had it last year at like one of the bigger like halls in town and they <laughs> and for that it was just like a whole lot of teachers all gathered um looking at all the things that that all the schools did throughout the year and then you know people receiving their their um awards there was even like things to do like things to make and like active little activities on the side which i thought was cute um but this year because of everything um it was a lot smaller basically just like the people who were receiving awards and the people who actually work at the Office of Education were the only ones there. So, yeah. I expected this award to just be like a piece of paper. I honestly thought it was going to be like a certificate or something. Tell me why. <laughs> Tell me why I saw a bunch of boxes stacked because they were taking out the prizes the not prizes the awards to give out to people like individually right so i saw these boxes just getting stacked and then <laughs> and then this was taken out of the box <laughs> i'm so i mean like literally my only i feel like more than like getting the the actual award because I really did expect it to be just like a certificate I didn't expect it to be anything more than a piece of paper um which I still would have been happy and like grateful for but the fact that they spelt my name correctly <laughs> the fact that they spelt my name correctly was like yes yes I told myself to change my shoes before leaving the car why am I still in these shoes? <laughs> there is ice on the floor. Oh, my goodness. Hi. Well, look. I freaking love how this place looks when there is snow. Even just a little bit because there's so many mountains around us that... The slightest bit of snow just makes everything so freaking pretty. I freaking love this spot. No swimming. Warning. Cold water. Heart failure. That's really all you need to know. <laughs> the, the thing is, the part that says, um, warning cold water literally that's all it says in korean it doesn't say anything about heart failure except for in english <laughs> so they're just making sure no foreigners die out here <laughs> One more time, 
travel far places five distances I can kind of take a break before driving and just be like hey I'm gonna you know take a walk for a few minutes rest to myself when I have time that is sometimes I have to like go immediately after one thing that I gotta go immediately to the next but today I have a little bit more time because I've already spoken to my schools that I would have had to work at today and told them, hey, I'm leaving early today and to the school that I won't be having any classes at, unfortunately. I was like, guys, sorry, but I think this is going to take some time. <laughs> so, yeah. But 